Several national leaders, including Prime Minister Datuk Seri Najib Tun Razak, his deputy Datuk Seri Dr Ahmad Zaid Hamidi, and Defence Minister Datuk Seri Hishamuddin Tun Hussein, arrived at Istana Besar to pay their last respects to Tunku Abdul Jalil. Former Deputy Prime Minister Tan Sri Muhyiddin Yassin also came to pay his last respects. Guests joined a congregation to perform the Solat Jenazah inside the Singhasana led by the Royal Palace Imam after the Zohor prayers. The casket containing the remains of Tunku Laksamana Johor, Tunku Abdul Jalil Sultan Ibrahim, was then brought down from Istana Besar Singhasana to be taken to the Mahmudia Royal Mausoleum for burial. 25 policemen and 25 Johor military force personnel carried the casket down the Istana Besar's main steps. The casket was laid on the royal hearse Opadati. The Sultan of Johor, Sultan Ibrahim Sultan Iskandar, led the group for the three-kilometer route to the Mahmudia Royal Mausoleum. Tunku Makota Johor, Tunku Ismail and Tunku Temenggung Johor, Tunku Idris accompanied Tunku Abdul Jalil's remains in the royal hearse. Tunku Ismail had paid tribute to his late brother in a moving post calling him a source of strength and inspiration.